now, today's top stories and Power of Five weather from News 5, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. Hey there, I'm Power 5 meteorologist Trent McGill. We're cold to start, but we get back to about freezing. That's with snowflakes, though. Snow showers arriving right around midday for most of Northeast Ohio. We'll keep an eye on this, but it looks like the heaviest stuff holds off until we get into that evening drive. Now, that being said, minor accumulations, but even one inch during the evening commute can really mess with that drive. So plan ahead for this. Just know that we have this rolling through. It gets out of here quickly overnight tonight. Your Friday morning drive could be a little on the slick side, but most of the snow should be gone and out of here. As far as how much we're expecting today, trace to two, most of us right at around that one inch mark. This weekend, completely different story that we've got snow arriving throughout your Saturday, heavy snow throughout Saturday afternoon and evening, lake effect Sunday and Monday. We have to break out the shovels this weekend. Everybody's going to break out the extra layers, though. Some of the coldest air we've had so far this season, this weekend. It's going to be interesting. A Terrence and Katie here in the News Box Studios with a look at the stories people are talking about today. Governor Mike DeWine will be making his case to save jobs in Lordstown today. He's meeting with the head of General Motors in Detroit. 1,500 people will lose their jobs when that plant closes in March. And a group of homeowners and a business in Akron are blaming this city for damages due to a sewer project. They filed a lawsuit this week. The homeowners are asking the city to move their properties, take them into similar homes. The owner of the bar wants paid for loss of business. Warrior Beat is bringing veterans together for a drum circle to ease the effects of things like PTSD and chronic pain. The group is located in Canton, but it's expanding to Cleveland next month. Check back later today for another update and download the News 5 app for breaking news and alerts. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.